Welcome to Leroy Drive's library. What a fabulous place. My friend Cora came to visit the library the other day and she was such a good patron that I decided to take pictures of her visit to be able to show you all of the great things she did. When Cora first walked into the library, she returned her library book in the book return. Then she walked down along the counter to hang up her library card. Next, Cora walked nicely over to the reading rug and found a good spot to sit for the read aloud. Cora loves listening to Miss Myrani read books. She sits up nice and tall, paws to herself, and listens to every word. Sometimes Miss Myrani even lets Cora and the other library visitors help read the stories. Now is Cora's favorite part. She gets to find a library book to borrow and bring home to read with her family. First, she goes to the chapter book section, but she realizes that chapter books are still a bit too difficult for her. She remembers to go along the long wall of picture books to find a just right book. There are so many good books in the library. Cora knows just the book she is looking for, but the library has thousands of books and how can she find just the right one? Being such a good library patron, Cora knows that she can use the library's catalog on the computer to help her find where the book is that she wants. She types in her keyword, D-O-G-S. Dogs, that's it. Look, Cora has found the section of dog books. She is even using a shelf marker. Do you see the shelf marker holding the book's place on the shelf? It looks like she has found just the right book. She is all ready to stamp the due date on the card inside the front cover. Library books can be borrowed for two weeks at a time. If Cora wants to keep this book longer than the two weeks, she can ask Miss Myrani or Miss Swank to renew it and she will get to borrow it for another two weeks. It's great! Cora usually likes to read a lot though, so when she is done reading this book in a few days, she will bring it back to the library and be able to choose a new one. After stamping the due date for the book, Cora gets her library card out of the holder and brings it down the counter with her book to Miss Swank's computer. Cora is such a pro in the library. She even remembers to turn the book over so that Miss Swank can easily scan the barcode on the back of the book to check it out. Now that Cora has checked out her library book, she decides to find a comfy spot back on the reading rug and quietly reads to a friend until it is time to line up. The library is full of fun things, like stuffed animals. They are great to read to. Cora always makes sure to put them back where she got them before she leaves. It's almost time to line up and go back to class. Cora is now at the comfy couch near the doorway reading her book. What a good reader! The more you practice reading, the better you get. Cora will be able to read those chapter books in no time. Well, time to line up. Cora is waiting in line. What a good girl, facing forward, paws to herself, and patiently waiting for her teacher to pick the class up. Cora, it's time for your close-up, silly. There you go, pretty girl. Miss Myrani loves to see visitors come to the library that love books and know just what to do. What a visit to the library. Cora had so much fun. She's excited to take her library book home to show her family, but she knows to take good care of the book and bring it back when she is done. Woo! All that fun wears Cora out. There's so much to do at the Leroy Library. See you soon!